Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel for today's video. So today I'm going to be sharing with you a bunch of freezer meals. I'm super excited. I'm going to be showing you how you can make six dinners in under an hour. I literally did this in 45 minutes. I thought it was going to take me two hours to complete this, but it took me 45 minutes. You can take 45 minutes out of your time and make yourself six dinners that you can throw in the slow cooker. These are all slow cooker recipes and they're super easy and yummy. So let's go ahead and jump right in. But before we do, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you're new and everybody give this video a thumbs up and let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so the first one I'm going to be making is a five ingredient meatball ravioli casserole. So I'm gonna show you all the ingredients for that one. So obviously what you're going to need is zipper bags, Italian style meatballs or any kind of meatballs you like, a half of frozen ravioli, a can of tomato sauce, marinara sauce, whatever, cheese, and then it calls for evaporated milk, but I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is just put all this stuff into the bags and then I'm going to leave out the milk and when I make it in the crock pot, I'll just put in the half a cup of milk that it calls for. And it also calls for a little bit of water if your sauce is thick. So let's go ahead and put this one together. note so it does say to put the cheese in a little separate baggie and like tape it onto the ziploc bag so um, I'm just gonna go ahead and leave the cheese out again I'm not sure why I think I've seen people freeze cheese in the meals before but um, it'll be fine Here's two meals from just the one bag of meatballs and raviolis and a jar and a half of pasta sauce. And then, like I said, you can just leave your cheese out. I guess that way, when you put it in the crock pot, it doesn't all separate and then you can just add your cheese at the end. So two meals down, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the next recipe I'm going to be making is beef tips and rice. Obviously the rice is not gonna be in here, so it's just gonna be like the beef tips and the sauce. So. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make that. I only got enough meat to make one of those meals, so um, that's what I'm going to do.
Okay, so this next recipe I'm making is a cilantro lime chicken, and I am adapting it from um, just a regular crock pot meal, so not a freezer meal. So I'm doing my best. The original recipe didn't even have actual measurements. Um, so I'm just going to do my best and throw it all together and just make adjustments if you see that it's getting too dry. And yeah, so obviously you need cilantro, limes. She called for five limes, but she said squeeze several limes, so. Garlic powder or garlic salt, whatever. Um, chicken broth, I'm using chicken bone broth. One onion cubed and salt and pepper. On September 25th so make sure you hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already so you don't miss that one I'm gonna be sharing another yummy crock pot recipe so I hope you enjoyed these six dinners in under literally 45 minutes I can't believe it I thought it was gonna take me two hours but it took me 45 minutes to make six dinners and I'm super excited about it I hope this helps you out and I hope you try some of these recipes if you do leave a comment down below letting me know which one was your favorite and I will try to link the recipes in the description box or I will leave a link to my blog depending I haven't decided how I'm gonna do it if I'm just gonna list the recipes down below or if I'm gonna um, leave a link to my blog with um, 
the recipes on it. Either way, you'll know. I'll leave it down below where you can find all the recipes if you don't want to just write it down from the video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!